Welcome to Purple Bandidos, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. I'm Purple Rodri. In the last episode, we learned how to spin, as well as got our mission here in this strange looking place. We were told that by collecting Grand Stars, we will be able to restore this ship to its full power. Now, we only have one area unlocked as of now, and it is the Terrace. So let's go ahead and walk inside. Welcome! This dome acts as an eye of the observatory. From here, we can gaze upon distant galaxies. Once this Luma transforms into a pole star, he will guide you to those faraway galaxies. Simply point your at the star, pole star, and press A. So it looks like this is how we're going to be accessing the galaxies. We have to make our ways inside of these weird looking places, and then from here, we will be able to latch on. And from here, we have made it to our first galaxy. These are the galaxies that can be observed from this dome. The numbers represent their distance from the observatory. The bigger the number, the greater the distance. The more power stars you find, the farther you'll be able to travel. All right, so we can start right here. It says a new galaxy has appeared. So let's go ahead and get this started and make our way to the first world, the Good Egg Galaxy. Yes, it's undeniable. We're detecting power star energy patterns in the nearest galaxy, but I must warn you that the evil energy readings are off the charts. Please be careful. Evil is not my middle name. Uh, but, but yes, we are still going to be flying there, and let's go ahead and get this adventure started. This is where all the crazy fun dumbness, probably me dying quite a bit, is going to begin. Because I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys now, I am not that great at Mario games. I'm okay. I kind of know what I'm doing. I basically know how to jump and stomp on the heads of the enemies, but I am not that fantastic. So it says, good at galaxy Dino Piranha. Welcome to the galaxy. I'm liking this place already. Uh, it looks kind of neat. Let me go ahead and just jump around here and see if I can follow a path. I think we basically just have to go on the other side of this and we'll be headed in the right direction. There's a little thing right over here and there's also a Luma. My friends are ahead, hurry. How the heck do I jump to that star? Oh, very sweet, the Luma transformed. It looks like I am doing things correctly right off the bat. That is a surprise, especially for me because I am gonna be having some fantastic moments in this game. Uh, you just wait. Let me go ahead and dodge these. Uh, what, what are those things anyways? L lava looking rocks? I, I have no idea. They, they look very strange to me. They look like they have a ruby in the middle of them. Why in the heck would there be a planet full of rubies and you would not be sitting here, you know, freaking crushing them for them. Let's keep running around. I'm guessing that it is five. Yes, it is. I can see the big little star thing on the screen. Now I just need to find it. I don't want to die either. I'm going to try to go without dying for as long as possible. Uh, because I, I probably will die quite a bit in this game. Where is this last one? I, I can't seem to find it. Uh, let me talk to this Luma. Maybe it's like hiding it from me. If you get hurt, grab a coin. Fantastic. Yeah. That, that, that's the advice I need right now, not for you to tell me where the heck this last coin is. This this last... Why, why, what am I stepping on? Mud? Seriously, I don't even know what the heck that is. Alright, I'm just gonna keep running around here. I'm sure I will find it eventually. I don't think it's on this one. Uh, there it is. It, I, I did, never saw it because it was on the bottom of it. But we've collected all five, and that is gonna open up a new path for us. Very nice. I, I like doing this little spinny majig. It feels like I'm a, a ballerina, a dancer, that I'm suited for it. And it's something I'm enjoying these days. Oh, we got a bunch of these little star bits. That's pretty dang cool. And there's also a piranha here. I'm pretty sure if you, you can shoot it with your Wemo and then stun it. Um, and there we go. I stepped on its head. And its head was transformed into a vine. Because that is how science works, I guess. Let me go ahead and spin the Wemo like it's asking me. And we've also landed on this one. This is very cool. I like that we get the chance to go in between so many dang planets and have these weird looking objects uh, suck on my head. That That's fantastic. Where, where am I supposed to go exactly? Oh my gosh, I fell in a hole. And I guess that is too bad because that is going to be the first of many, many deaths. All right, let's continue on from here then. And where... I see another piranha over there, so I'm guessing that's what I'm gonna have to do. I didn't realize that there was another mother fudging. Once again, I realize that there's another piranha here, and I have finally made the jump after three freaking attempts. That that really shows you the way this is gonna go. It's gonna be a lot of me failing, but but hopefully I will get better. I am hoping that uh, once we come. Uh, further in this adventure I will be a lot better at controlling this game I'm gonna keep heading up through here we're having another one of these little switch puzzles which I remember from what we did first 
Okay, oh, wait, do I have to step on all of them? I don't even remember, but I think we do. Oh, crap. I'm doing this wrong. All right, I'm going to go up here, here. Oh, this is no Zelda now. This is no Zelda. There we go. I figured it out. And they have all turned into little green squares. So let, let, let's keep the motion going before I start triggering in even more things and, and killing myself off a little more. We're going to another one of these green-looking planets. Why is this place called Peter Piranha? What the heck is that in the ground? Am I stuck? Okay, okay. I thought that thing was going to pop out at me. I thought some crazy uh, cutscene or something was coming there. I'm going to keep dodging these enemies, which I'm not sure what they're called. They don't seem to be Goombas to me. So I, I will not be worrying about them. I'm going to keep crushing this. And let's go for another spin into a Yoshi egg. Why is there a Yoshi egg flying around this galaxy? I don't know. This is, this is starting to... Oh, wow. There's a huge egg here, too. Hey, what are, what's in here, buddy? Is there is there something nice hiding inside of there? I'm guessing this is who we have to fight. Do I just... Maybe I'll just smack it. Can I just smack... Oh, it's tail. Oh, what was I thinking? There we go. Smack its tail. It crushes its shell. And then comes a big piranha-looking fellow. All right. Let's run away from this little guy. Um, I think I just have to hit its tail, honestly. And that's gonna be it. Yes. Hit its tail. Oh, look at me. Playing like a pro. Is that all it's gonna take? One hit, dude? One hit? Oh, no. It is angry. Its face turned red. Oh, wow. Wow, it's moving fast as heck. Uh, move. Get up, Mario. Get up, get up, get up. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm at one. I need to go find me some coins. Please, I'm running out of here. I need a, I need a miracle. I need a miracle. Holy crap. Give me a coin. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Get the heck. Chase it. It's chasing me. It's chasing me. Oh, got it. Okay, thank goodness. Got it for the second time. Whew, that was worrying me a little bit. I guess it's going to be the old Nintendo number. Third time's the charm. And third time is also the charm to kill me. Let me get it still. Got it. Thank goodness. I thought I was about to die there once again. That was a close one. And I'm guessing that was probably the easiest the battles are going to get. I, I really need to get better at this. So by the end of this, I am a professional plumber that can jump around and step on uh, plants. All right, here we go. This is our first star. There we go. So very sweet, now we got ourselves one grand star and one normal star, making it two. Very cool, Let, let's go back in there and let's continue this, uh, because we've been doing quite well. I guess I'll save the game, why not? The game wants me to save, because if I don't, I'm probably going to be dying a couple more times. Star bits, tasty. Aim your at the screen and point at them to pick them up. Once you have, shoot them. Yes, yes, I kind of figured that out, little Goomba. Oh, thank you, giving me a little snack, I like it. No, I, I don't want to aim though. Just give me them. And now, where'd you go? Where are you? Am I gonna have to shoot them at them? Oh yes, look, that's the ticket. That's the ticket. All right, where, where is the, where, where can I pull myself up? I don't know, I think we have to walk in and out. Maybe, maybe that's what we have to do. Wait, oh, are you that hungry, little guy? All right, I guess I'm gonna keep, oh wow, it got chubbier and then, mmm, tasty. Let's call those little morsels my fee for this lesson. So we are able to shoot star bits at Lumas. Now that's very interesting. That could actually come in handy later on. We could be feeding a whole population here before we know it. Let's keep going to Good Egg Galaxy. Let's see if we can knock in a couple more stars. It would be cool if we could actually finish off a galaxy uh, quickly. That would be quite nice because I know we have a lot of galaxies that we're going to have to explore. A snack of cosmic proportions. Here we go. I'm guessing that this mission is going to take some sort of uh, Goomba Luma feeding in order for us to beat it. So I'm hoping that we can find the right way we need to go and just continue from there. I'm going to go back up here because I'm thinking maybe we'll be able to do something in this location again. If not, then it was worth the check. Uh, if not, we will look around somewhere else. All right, a bunch of star bits, which will probably come in handy later on. I know that you can actually use star bits uh, to feed a bunch of different Lumas later on or something, but I, I don't know exactly uh, where the heck we're going to have to find them. What the heck is this? I don't know, but I'm going to walk around these walls because there might be something here we need later on. I'm going to go ahead and do this, and it's musical notes. Oh, very cool. All right, so as you follow these notes, it triggers some music. I like that. I am a very 
musical person. I, I like to listen to music, basically. That's what makes me a musical person. Preferably uh, some video game music. And there we go. We got ourselves a life. All right, come to me, because I'm sure as heck going to need you once I start getting uh, into more fights with more plants. I'm going to head back inside this pipe then, because I'm guessing this wasn't where we're supposed to go. I think I saw one outside anyways, too. I think there was a green pipe. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and take a guess that maybe that's the one we have to go to. Did, did I even see a green pipe? I, I don't remember what I did see or didn't see. But there is more to it in this world. There we go. There's, a, there's another staircase here, which I didn't notice the first time going through. I guess there's a lot of uh, differently arranged worlds in this, which we're going to be having to take care of. I've got a hungry friend up ahead. You don't mind sharing your snacks, do you? Not at all. If it means I get to jump around and... what? Oh, okay. All right, we're going to pull ourselves here. This is pretty cool. I guess we'll be having to do that quite a bit in this game. We're going to have to pull ourselves from location to location. And then maybe two more planets from there on out. Let me go ahead and knock this guy down. There we go. Let me do this. I'm going to kick your butt now, little guy. And I'm just going to collect as many star bits as possible. Because I know we are going to have to feed that hungry, hungry Luma. That should be a game. That would be fun. I would totally play that. Hungry, hungry Luma. And there we go. I found the star. I, these, these are always hidden everywhere, I have began to notice. So it's going to be keeping a keen eye for those in order for us to continue on in this galaxy. Oh, look at that. We got a checkpoint in between and more of these little flying ones. I hope that at a certain point we can get a life. I know that if you collect coins and stuff in other Mario games, uh, you can eventually get lives from them. And look. Hey, you. Yeah, you got any tasty star bits? All right. I'm going to feed this guy. How many does he need? A hundred? What? Are you freaking kidding me? How many do I have right now? 44. Where in the heck am I going to pull a hundred star bits from? All right. I got myself like five here. That's not bad. And I, I heard a one up. So I'm guessing we are doing something right. Maybe there's enough here uh, for us to be able to give it to it. If not, then I'm guessing we are going to have to look around in the other planets that were near here in order to feed it. Let's go hop back in the star. I didn't know it was going to be a hundred. Um, so I guess we'll have to go back there and feed it. Or maybe that wasn't it because I think we're heading back to... Wait, we have been here before. Okay, let's collect as many of these as I can. I might have to make my way back to where we were before in order to collect even more. A hundred? That's kind of that's gonna be a toughie for me because I've, I haven't been collecting any of these. If I if I would have known we were gonna use them, I probably would have collected them from the start. I didn't realize they were gonna be a hundred. All right, we're at eighty. There's a bunch hitting here. You know what? I'm gonna head back into this one because I think this will send me back to the original galaxy we were on. And there were a ton there. So if we can find you know at least twenty there, we should be looking quite good. Uh, what? Oh yeah, I saw I saw some. Oh yeah, this is it. Look at this. This is the magic. There's like a ton over here. I'll get to 100 here. Easy. No problem. And there, there, there's another one of those little things. No, no, no. Drop down. I'm going to get 100 and we're going to take it to the Hungry Luma. I, I think, I think that's the Hungry Luma. If not, I don't know. We're going to be uh, flying through the galaxy to a, to a wrong one or something. I'm also at one life, so I don't want to risk dying. Um, and there's another one of these here. I'm going to go ahead and hop here. I'm guessing there's probably coins. Come here. Jump. Jump. Oh, wow. Never mind. They are just more of these little things. I, I don't know where we're supposed to be headed, but you know what? I'm going to head back the way we came because I'm guessing that the Hungry Luma is where we need to go. What? What is this? That's it? You're not going to send me anywhere? Well, you were a waste of time. Ah, let's take this one on then. Why not? We might as well try something new around here. And I think this might take us back to where we need to be, actually. And I think it is, actually. Yes. Is this it? Yes. There's the Hungry Luma. Fantastic. And I'm going to go ahead and start feeding it. It's saying more. Open that belly. I'm going to go ahead and spam it with 100. And hopefully this is enough to satisfy its craving. Freaking crazy, crazy Luma. There we go. That's it. I'm stuffed. Here we go. Transform. Majin Boo. And it transformed into a new planet. Is that where I'm supposed to go? Heck, let's 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 keep going. It might be, it might not. If it's not, then either way, we probably did something that we were supposed to. So uh, it's no no trouble whatsoever. Let's go jump on top of this, and let's just keep climbing up, because I'm guessing that up is the only way to go, guys. That that is the truth about life. There, don't stay down. Always go up. I, I can't do a backflip up there, can I? Let me do it here. Oh, wow. I can probably do it from this location. Where is this star, by the way? I've been looking for it for quite a while, and I, I must be headed the wrong way or something. Can I? All right. 
No, I'm gonna have to black, 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 black. Got it. There's a coin here. Nice. Give me the coin. As you can see, I'm not as used to the controls as usual. I've been used to doing a lot of RPGs. So this is the first time I've done a platformer in a while. All right, that shot me off. Hopefully to the right place. And hopefully I will be able to get my star once and for all. What the heck am I doing here? It, wow, am I going to have to run through that? If I do, that is going to be very, very tricky. And I, I actually don't want to do that. That's going to be very difficult, I can see already. But where the heck do we start? Let me go ahead and break this. Maybe there's some entrance for me to take on. Run around! Run around the weird-looking galaxy until you find an entrance. Because that's the way to do these things. What in the heck is going on? This is really, really confusing. I wish I knew what I was doing. Can I start here? All right, there, there must be an entrance somewhere that I'm not seeing. I'm guessing there is, and I'm probably just having a blonde moment here and not being able to keep track. Could I, could I, what in the mother fudging? I'll be back once I figure this out. All right, so there you go. I found the entrance. It was here in a little hole, and now we're able to continue through here. Hopefully, I am now headed in the way I am supposed to to make it to the top, which will hopefully get us the star we've been looking for for a really long time. I like these little weird controls because I'm, I'm flipping over the worlds, and I'm kind of liking it. It's a little bit confusing. Was that it? What, what is this? Is that where I came in? I don't know. Maybe that is. I'm going to go ahead and backflip. No, come on. I can do this. I am Mario the Plumber. We can backflip onto that. I, I hope. I, I No, we can't. We can't. All right, let's go up here then, even though I think I already took this path. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm headed in the right direction. I didn't even realize it. Wouldn't that be something special? Let's keep on going. Oh, okay. These platforms push you down. I guess I had a bit of a blonde moment there. I'm not used to this, like I was saying. So things can get a little confusing here once in a while. Let's keep on going up, though. Uh, this this star has taken quite a bit of time actually. I was a little surprised This is probably not even the one we're supposed to do but heck we've been doing it So why not finish it now that we're this far in? And that is leading us to wow, that is a big one and hopefully our star is there Oh, Okay, this is the correct one then uh, because that is what I saw uh, at the beginning of this adventure. Cool. I, I guess we did do it right. Good job, everybody. High fives all around. We have actually collected the star we were supposed to. I know that it can become very difficult as you go on in this game, so I'm glad that we were able to keep track here uh, without too much trouble. I'm actually a little, a little troubled here because I'm getting a little confused about this jumping mechanism. Let me go ahead and get the fourth one and then the fifth one, and I'm guessing that would open up the path for us to collect our next star. Very cool, it opened up these majiggers. I'm just gonna go ahead and pull myself. There, pull myself, got it, and there we go. This is our third star. All right, we have opened up a new galaxy, which is great for us, but we will actually continue on to that in the next episode. So if you guys have any tips on these galaxies coming up, let me know, because things are just getting started and they're getting tricky. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.